Welcome, welcome to the woodshed for October 23rd and 24th weekend. Let's roll countdown in three, two, one. Howdy, guys. Welcome to Heart for the Harvest 2021. It is one of the coolest things we do. We get to believe God for miraculous things. It is how we push our vision forward. It is how we look for life change. And it's how we experience the presence of the Holy Spirit in the everyday things we do. It's going to be an incredible season. This is the first weekend. Pastor Kyle is going to be bringing the message. I'll give you some more details about that in a minute. But just for now, all you need to know, multi-sites, you guys are only going to be playing the top two tunes, which are cool Rest to to On Us story, and Every but before Victory. You rest away, On Us, this is the countdown that goes into Rest On Us. When it's one, two, six, four in the key of A. We'll go to Every Victory. We can help you with that. Uh, from there, we'll go Check to Hosting, Promote Tricks and Treats, which is coming up Instagram, next weekend. Spooky season is upon us. This Generosity and, and child dedication. At that point, See you this Wednesday and right there, uh, we will pick it up uh, on Resi. House of Miracles will come from Pellissippi. Message and the interview minister time that will all come from Pellissippi. Again, when we get there, I'll give you a few more details, but just know that's going to be Pellissippi only starting after child dedication, all the way through the gospel. So, ministry time, all those tunes at the bottom, those are potentials. And we'll go to the gospel, that will be back at your location. So, gospel will be at your location, and campus closing will be at your location. Again, it's a little bit different weekend, but it is going to be a spirit filled weekend. An incredible one. People are going to experience healing, life change. You guys get to be a part of it. It is a privilege. We're so thankful for you. So again, these are the two up top that you guys will be responsible for. Big Bell. Big promise, welcome to church. Come on, stand to your feet. Welcome the presence of the Lord here today. We lift our voices, we sing, come on. As the Spirit was moving over the water, the Spirit come move over us. Come rest on us. Come rest on us. As the Spirit was moving over the water, the Spirit come move over us. Come rest on us. Let's go to the bridge, bring it all the way down. We sing.
Come out with Tom's next song, Every Victory. Church, how is everybody doing this weekend? Awesome. My name is Tucker McGinnis, and I have the privilege of serving on staff here at Faith Promise Church. 
And we wanted to say that we are so honored that you chose to worship with us this weekend. If it is your first time here joining us, we want you to know that we are real people with real problems. And our goal is to help people find the real love of Jesus Christ. We have a communication card that's going to pop up via a QR code on the screens behind me. It's also in the seat in front of you. If you'll open up that camera app on your phone, scan that. It'll take you directly to faithpromiseconnect.com where you can fill out that online communication card. Those communication cards are so vital for you to take your next steps here at Faith Promise Church. And speaking of next steps, we have a four-week experience every weekend during our 1130 service across all of our campuses called Next Steps. We like to say next step is your next step. And so that could be a next step in hopping into an area to serve for the first time or maybe hopping into a small group or maybe it's a, it's a faith step in um, salvation or baptism, whatever that may be, we highly encourage you to hop into our Next Steps classes. 100% guarantee you will not regret doing it. So hop in wherever you are all across every campus, jump into Next Steps. Another exciting thing coming up in the life of our church, starting tomorrow, October 25th, we will be starting our 21 days of prayer together. What a special time as a church body that we get to come together and intercede um, just for what we're believing God for during this Heart for the Harvest season. So that may be you interceding for yourself, your family, your friends, the church, your ministry, whatever that may be. We want to come alongside you as a church family and pray together. It's going to be such a powerful time. I look forward to it every year. And church, lastly, we wanted to mention again that Tricks and Treats is coming up next weekend for FP Kids. Hey, stand by, stand and by. So this is the last thing. we want to show you a little bit of the fun here on this video. So check this video out. Two, three, four, set it down. <laughs> cool. All right. So that is the first two tunes and hosting. So right here, you're going to be loading on your child dedication people. Uh, we'll do child dedication next. Um, and then that will roll straight into generosity. So drummers, when the countdown hits three, you'll go ahead and fire that pad that you have. That's track four. That will go behind generosity. And then uh, they'll go straight in, in child dedication. Ooh, child dedication will pray, surprise. and that yes, will transition oh, your right, worship you team back out. And At that point, we will go live to Pellissippi. So House of Miracles is going to come from our broadcast location, and then Pastor Kyle will walk out. He will do just a quick setup. And the idea behind this weekend is to really experience this kind of Holy Spirit healing. And so he's going to walk us through just kind of some guided prayers and pray for all of our locations, honestly. He's going to ask for just some supernatural knowledge, supernatural revelation for things that we need to pray for. Uh, so that whole back half of the service should be a really sweet time. Uh, we're going to weave worship in and out of that. He, he'll speak first. He's going to bring a couple of our yep. worship volunteers. Andy and Kate Whitehead are going to come and share their story. Love them. It's going to be incredible. And then that will segue us into praying for some of the things that God has laid on Pastor Kyle's heart. People who need healing will stand up we'll across all of our locations and receive that. And then uh, coming out of that, he'll, he'll wrap it up. We'll go to Gospel Back Live at all locations. So we'll cut Resi off there and do campus closing. But this whole next segment after Child Dedications will come from Pellissippi, from Broadcast Campus. So multi-site teams, just be aware that that music will come over from Pellissippi as well. Amen, church. Well, the families you see on stage today are part of that kids' ministry who gets to do amazing creative things like you just saw. Tricks and Treats is just one of the many things we do. And so we're seeing some of our newest members of the FP family. Let's give it up for them and their parents right now. Yay, God. Yay, little babies. They're so sweet. So cool. All right, we're going to covenant together as a church and a family that we're going to raise these kids up. We're going to instill in them the principles that God has called us to do. And so uh, will you join us? Will you covenant in prayer together with us as we pray over these new families, commission their children to a life of service to God, following his plan for their life. In Jesus' name, pray, 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 pray. Down the line we go. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Right here, your families will walk off. They'll exit whatever side of the stage is best for you at your location. And your segue will go something like this. Well, the people you just saw are not just sweet little children that we want to pray over. They are the future leaders of this house. They are the future worship leaders, kids small group leaders, 
Student pastors, we have no idea what God has in store for them. He knows uh, right now it is just, they're just, they look like little children, but they are future world changers. We believe in the next generation. We believe strongly in building a place that's going to outlive those who built it. And so uh, part of that is, part of building that vision is being generous and contributing to the future of our church. And so right now we get a chance to be generous and pour into that next generation. You can make an investment in people just like the ones you just saw in those who will lead this congregation long after all of us are gone. Isn't that cool that we get to do that? Here's five ways that we can. Up on the screen behind me, you can give online, text the number, drop it in the bucket, go to the kiosk, or if you still like to involve stamps and a five-day wait, then you can mail it too, I guess. All right, cool. Well, hey, we're going to do something different again this weekend. We're going to link up live to our Pellissippi location. We're going to experience the Holy Spirit. We're going to experience what He has for us in the way of supernatural healing. We've got a great word from Pastor Kyle this weekend. Will you join us? We're going to join together our broadcast location. We're all going to worship together right now. Will you stand with us and sing? So again, this is going to come from Felicity. Verse 2, 3. This is how some heal. Our hearts are full of faith. You have our full attention. You have a final Let's go to the chorus. Give me some light drums. Two, three, four. Come alive in the name of Jesus. Come alive in the name of Jesus. This is a house of miracles. We bring everything to the feet of Jesus. Everything in the name of Jesus. This is a house of Tom's in. Add some Tom's in. Give me the rest of the band. Going to the bridge next. Drums, give me a straight bill. Band, give me a straight bill. Going to the bridge. Bridge, bridge. So Pastor Kyle will walk into that moment right here. He's going to speak. So again, we may not know. He may want to go back to that song. He may not, but we'll be, we'll be prepared either way. This will all come from broadcast location. Pastor Kyle is going to speak for about 20 or so minutes, just kind of set up the whole experience. Again, we believe miracles still happen today. We believe supernatural healing. We believe in Jehovah Rapha. That wasn't just a promise for the Old Testament. That wasn't just a promise for the time of the apostles. That is a thing that's still happening today. And we're going to share a story of that after his 20 minutes of that. Again, Andy and Kate Whitehead will come. They will get to share a little bit about their healing story. Uh, two of our great worship volunteers, they get to share their story, and then we'll segue into a time of healing across all of our locations, still coming from broadcast, but we're going to ask for a word of knowledge, people who need to be prayed over at all locations. So we'll invite people to stand as they see fit whenever we pray for certain things. That segment will be weaved in and out of worship. Now, we're not going to demonstrate that today because obviously we don't know what the Spirit is going to say, but there are some songs on the order for the Pellissippi team. I would just say be familiar with those tunes. We may do some 
all or maybe even none of the ones that are listed, but be familiar with those entire tunes. We're going to flow in and out of those things, kind of like if you've been part of a Saturday morning prayer experience. That's kind of the vibe, only with a full, with a full team instead of acoustic. So Pastor, uh, Pastor Kyle will come out, he'll pray, he'll ask for word and knowledge, we'll pray, and then the worship team will kind of worship in concert with that. We'll flow in and out for that next 20 minutes over that segment. And when he's done, he's going to transition to the gospel. All right? You know, the, uh, the one who died on the cross is the one who gave us access. Scripture says the same power that raised Jesus from the dead is alive in us. That is where we access our healing, all these miracles we're believing for today. So if you've never had a chance to experience that, we want to lead you in a simple prayer where you can meet that Savior for the first time. Will you bow your heads? Pray, pray, pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Church, let's give it up for those who just made the best decision they'll ever make. All right. Campus specific items right here. We will do campus closing. Don't forget, next week, be back for Tricks and Treats. It's going to be incredible. Bring your family, bring your friends, bring your neighbor's kids, bring your kids' neighbors. Whatever you got to do, get them here. Let's get them saved. We love you. Peace.